The CEO of BYD has launched an engine that has created a stir in the entire auto industry. Imagine a hybrid engine that runs not only on petrol and not just on battery, but combines the power of both and does such a wonder that other companies are also stunned. This is BYD's new fifth generation DMI hybrid system, which is not just an upgrade of technology, but a revolution in the world of cars. The most surprising thing is that with this system, once the battery is charged and the fuel tank is full, your car can run about 1,000 kilometers. Can this technology become the biggest threat to Tesla and other EV companies? And will people leave EV and return to hybrid in the coming years? After all, what technology has been installed in this new engine? And why can this new engine shake up the entire EV industry? So before moving ahead in the video, subscribe to the channel so that you can be the first to see such explosive videos. What is this fifth gen DMI hybrid system? Imagine you have a car that can drink petrol as well as consume electricity and uses both so smartly that you get great mileage, strong performance, and no tension of frequent charging or going to the petrol pump. This is the magic of BYD's new 5th gen DMI hybrid system. Now hearing the name, you must be thinking, what is this DMI? So, understand in simple language. DM means dual mode, i.e. technology, that runs in two ways. And I mean it's intelligent system control which itself decides when to use the petrol engine and when the electric motor. The old hybrid technology often had the problem that either the car consumed more petrol or the range was very less in electric mode. But 5th gen DMI has almost eliminated this problem. A high efficiency petrol engine has been installed in this system which can drive the car on its own and also does the work of charging the battery. A powerful electric motor and a large battery pack are attached to it. When you are driving at low speeds, like in city traffic or for short distances, this system runs the car only with the electric motor. That means no noise, no smoke and fuel savings. But as soon as you need more power, like overtaking on the highway or covering a long distance, this petrol engine turns on and provides power support and also charges the battery. In the old-fashioned hybrid system, the petrol engine often ran more and the electric motor just gave light support. But in DMI, the game is the opposite. Here, the electric motor is the main driving force and the petrol engine comes in a supporting role, which reduces fuel consumption a lot. The petrol engine used by BYD in this has a thermal efficiency of more than 46%, which is a record level in the auto industry, meaning the engine uses as much energy as possible from the petrol in driving the car with less waste. Another special thing is its smart power management system. Based on your driving pattern, road conditions, and battery level, it decides whether to drive in electric mode, hybrid mode, or just with the petrol engine. Due to this auto management, the car always runs in the most efficient mode and you do not face any situation that may cause a drop in mileage. Another feature of this fifth gen DMI system of BYD is the size of the battery and charging speed. The battery installed in it is so big that it gives a range of several hundred kilometers even in electric mode only and gets charged quickly with fast charging support. Moreover, even if the battery runs out, you can continue the journey without stopping with the petrol engine. That is the biggest problem of EV range anxiety is almost zero here. If you compare with old hybrids like Toyota Prius or Honda Accord hybrid, then there the petrol engine remains more active and the use of the electric motor is limited. But BYD's DMI system focuses on electric driving for longer periods of time and turns on the petrol engine only when needed, thereby increasing mileage manifold. This is why vehicles with this system can run for about two 100 kilometers on a single full tank and battery charge, which is almost unbelievable for any hybrid car today. So this fifth gen DMI system is much smarter, more efficient and more powerful than the old hybrid technology. It not only saves fuel, but also gives the fun of electric driving and the assurance of the range of a petrol engine. This is the reason why auto experts believe that if this technology is launched on a large scale, it can create a stir in both the EV and petrol industries. This move of BYD is a headache for other companies 
because it is giving customers a practical solution that eliminates both the weaknesses of EVs and the limitations of traditional hybrids. And if this technology reaches the global market on a large scale, then Tesla, Toyota, Honda and other auto giants may have to completely change their strategy and game plan for the coming years. BYD's 5th Gen DMI hybrid system is just a beginning, but the company's game plan for the coming years is quite big and far-reaching. Currently, BYD is starting to use this technology in some of its popular series such as Qin, Song, Han and Tang models so that it can first strengthen its hold in the Chinese market. But BYD's vision is not limited to the local market only. The company has made it clear that its plan is to take this technology to the international level. The first targets will be other Asian countries like India, Thailand, Indonesia and Malaysia where the EV infrastructure is not fully ready yet but people are interested in both electric electric and hybrid. Here, the two 100 km range and low fuel cost of this system can prove to be a direct hit. After this, BYD will look at Europe and Australia, where EVs are popular, but limitations of battery performance and charging networks still exist. BYD's entry plan in America will be a bit strategic because giants like Tesla and Ford are already present there. But if BYD launches its hybrid models here at a competitive price, then they can become popular quickly due to long range and low charging dependency, especially in those areas where there are fewer charging stations. This technology can become the first choice of the customer. Now the question is, Will this technology really destroy the EV industry? The answer is a bit in balance. The growth of the EV industry is still fast, but the truth is that a complete electric transition will take many more years. People are still grappling with the tension of range, charging time and battery replacement. This hybrid system of BYD is a middle path for those who want to buy an EV but are afraid of being completely dependent on electric. Market trends show that the demand for hybrid vehicles may increase in the coming five to seven years, especially in places where the charging network is still developing. Customer preference is also gradually leaning towards practical options, meaning people will not buy an EV just to be green, but they will want a vehicle that is reliable in every situation. BYD's fifth gen DMI meets this need. Given the pace of technology, other companies will either have to upgrade their hybrid systems or make such a big leap in EV technology that range and charging issues are eliminated. If they are unable to do so, brands like BYD can capture market share in the hybrid segment and slow down the growth of the EV industry. BYD's game plan for the coming years is clear. First, increase volumes in the local market, then gradually expand in Asia and Europe and finally enter big markets like the US and the Middle East. If this strategy works well and other companies are unable to respond in time, then this technology can prove to be a true disruption point for the EV industry. If you also think that this new hybrid system of BYD will change the game of the auto industry in the coming years, then subscribe to the channel to get more such explosive updates first. And don't forget to press the bell icon so that you do not miss the next big update.